Hey everybody. So um, people have been asking me a lot about Kami and how you can use Kami to insert text boxes that your students will then be able to edit the text boxes of. I hope that makes sense, but I'm about to show you how. So first thing I'm going to do is go ahead and present my screen to you. So this is a really fun um, presentation that uh, I believe Jade made. And I just want to show you guys how you can insert text boxes on top of this. So what we're going to do is click on text box, and then we're going to click right anywhere where we want our box to be. And I'm going to type insert text here. Now, the last thing I want to do, because um, when I click off of it, it's kind of hard to see. To show students this is going to be uh, an editable box, I'm going to go up here to fill color, and I'm going to go ahead and make that white. And I can change the shape however I want, right? But I've inserted text. Now I have insert text there. So that's perfect. I'm going to click save, even though Cami saved, uh, Cami saved it all automatically for me, actually, so I don't even have to click save. Because look, it says saved here. All right. So, example, inserting text boxes with Cami for students. I've attached that. I'm going to give it a title. I'm going to call this assignment example. And then I'm going to click assign. I didn't restrict any features with Cami, so, you know, that's just something to consider. Now I'll show you what this looks like from the student perspective in a second. Okay, so look, here's the assignment that I just assigned to a demo student in my New Zealand summer reading course. I'm going to go ahead and open that up, and then I'm going to click on the work. Then you can see my text box is here. Open with annotate with Cami. Should still be loading. All right, now this letter up for the student. When I hover over it, you can see that that box is still clickable. Students can then insert their own text all right and then they can click turn it in when they are doing oh, unsaved changes right we should probably saving changes that's important saved all right now we're going to click turn in turn it in and that's how you can do this um basically create text boxes for your students to work within in Canvas. If you have any questions, please don't hesitate to ask. I'm here for you. I think this is just another fun way that we can use Cami, and your students will uh, continue to grow uh, from this wonderful experience.